Welcome to Journaling Saturday, where you get journal prompts to help you develop deeper self-awareness and reclaim your inner magic. If you're new to the Magic Atelier, welcome. We are a magical soul tribe that values freedom and personal growth through introspection, learning, and creative explorations. We believe self-education is the key to building true wealth. So if you're into the law of attraction and personal development, you may enjoy subscribing to our channel, which includes all sorts of topics that relates to creating your freedom lifestyle. For journaling, we encourage digital journaling because it's nice to be able to save trees to cherish Mother Earth. And you can get very creative with digital journaling with stickers and images. If you're new to digital journaling, you can download our free The Magic Atelier digital journal in our links to get started. You can duplicate the pages as much as you like for note-taking and journaling. So let's dive into our journal prompts today. Today's topic is on discovering the limiting beliefs and processing the memories around heart chakra. In a previous video, we went over the ultimate guide to open your heart chakra with a list of symptoms of the blocked heart chakra to healing foods to many other useful methods that can heal and open your heart chakra. So be sure to check out that video so you can start to heal your heart chakra to receive unconditional love from the universe. With an open heart chakra, we rise above our human consciousness to higher realms of spirituality and unlock our inner magic for wealth, joy, and love. Go ahead and find a quiet, comfortable place for this exercise. Some recommended herbal teas you may consider to heal and open your heart chakra includes green tea, jasmine tea, hawthorn berry tea, mint tea, and rose tea. Since most green colored fresh veggies and fruits are helpful to heal heart chakra, a mixed green smoothie would be a good choice as well. Now grab your pet if you have one, open your digital journal, and reflect upon these journal prompts. Feel free to pause the video as needed. There is no right or wrong, so go at your own pace and enjoy your journey. Question 1. What does unconditional love mean to me? Question 2. How was love expressed in my family as a child? Question 3. How do I express love as an adult? What are my love languages? To find out what is your love language, you can consider taking the quiz from the website, The 5 Love Languages. Links are in the video description below. Question 4. What self-practices can I do every day to cultivate feelings of unconditional self-love? Question 5. In what areas of my life do I hold back or resist intimacy? And why? Question 6. Who am I having a hard time forgiving? What boundaries do they violate? And what is preventing me from forgiving? Question 7. What are some moments in the past where I felt loved? What part of my needs were fulfilled from those moments? Question 8. What limiting beliefs I may have that prevent me to connect to others or cause me to shut down or disconnect? Question 9. What part of me feel rejected or abandoned? 
What are the underlying unmet needs, and how can I bring them into the light for healing? Question 10. What are the 10 things I love most about myself? As the creator of the Magic Atelier, I want to share a bit about my experience. When I first got started on my healing journey, it was difficult to give myself unconditional love due to my upbringing. I was typically very self-critical and defined my worth from external things such as achievement, money, and approval. It took me a lot of deprogramming of childhood and societal conditioning to heal and realized my whole intention behind my actions was fear. It had caused me to have a scarcity mindset that I was never enough and felt unworthy. As I gained more self-awareness and spiritual growth, I let go of many limiting beliefs and realized that I am enough, we are enough, and all of us have unique magic within us. As quote by Carl G. Young, your visions will become clear only when you can look into your own heart. Who looks outside dreams, who looks inside awakes. I hope this video helped you gain greater awareness of yourself so that you can open up your heart chakra to receive the unconditional love and ignite the magic that is uniquely yours and it's already within you. May you receive lots of unconditional love and surround yourself with divine light and we'll see you in the next video.